All right, let's focus on the forecast now here at home. First alert meteorologist Kristen Emery joins us now. Kristen, we were just waterlogged yesterday. We saw it with the flooding. What's next for us? One day record total rainfall for Pittsburgh yesterday, and now most of that is over. We're still getting actually a little drizzle, a couple of little flurries here and there with chillier temperatures, but the flood advisory for the Ohio River in uh, Pittsburgh. This goes through Thursday at one o'clock, but this is about the only advisory we're seeing for flooding and we're expecting the Ohio, Ohio River to crest uh, maybe around 1 to 3 p.m. this afternoon. So everything will start receding as we head through tonight and tomorrow. So good news there. You see a little bit of activity on the radar here, but it's white. It's actually snow flurry activity, even a little sleep mixing in in other spots. We've seen patchy drizzle for the late morning, but as we head through this afternoon, chillier temperatures giving way to highs right there in the mid to upper 30. So we'll start to see some drier air and some cooler air move in. You can already see a little bit of this activity cutting off north of around I 80. So a couple of rounds of a few flurries or a light snow shower early afternoon temperatures right now in those mid 30s, but we'll be on our way to about 39 for the afternoon high. You can see some flurries right now in Pittsburgh at 35. Greensburg 34 with a couple of raindrops and even a couple of flurries in Connellsville at 33. Beaver 36 with just cloudy skies. So we'll inch up there close to 40 degrees by later this afternoon. Mostly cloudy again, a couple of flurries or snow showers early, but then overnight tonight we dry out cool down temperature by tomorrow morning right around 32 for the morning low. So not too cold tomorrow, a little bit above normal and those temperatures stay above normal all week. Rain chances we dry out for the day tomorrow. Tomorrow afternoon into tomorrow evening we have a couple of showers or rain snow showers mixing together through early Wednesday. Thursday and the early part of Friday will be dry. It'll be Friday night into Saturday when we get our next round for some rain showers. Look at these numbers. High temperatures the next few days starting tomorrow get into those 40s. We're going to end January the way we started with very warm temperatures. We had that little cold snap in the middle, but overall for the month, a very wet and a warm January for Pittsburgh. So here's future cast as we head through the afternoon. Get to around 39 for the high in Pittsburgh, some lower 30s, upper 20s for the highs in the Laurel Highlands. Overnight tonight, the clouds stick around. That keeps us relatively mild. Lows tomorrow morning only in the lower 30s. Dry for tomorrow with a high in the lower to mid 40s across the area. But you see the snow looming off to the west. By the time it arrives here, it'll mix with or change to a few rain showers tomorrow evening, lasting through Wednesday morning not amounting to much and then temperatures again Wednesday in the 40s. So 39 today, 32 your overnight low tonight. Tomorrow we get up to 44 for the afternoon high and then right around late afternoon and through dinner time, a few rain showers or snow showers mixing or alternating. No accumulation though, except possibly in the ridges. We could get a little coating Wednesday 43 with again very early morning rain snow should be dry by 8 AM 45 and dry Thursday. Nicest day of the week scattered rain showers for Groundhog Day Friday.